Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I am going to review this Fluke Threaded Alligator Clip Set, and the model on this one is AC175. And it says on the packaging, for use with the TL175 and TP175, those are test leads. And I have the TL75 test leads. I have verified on their website, the Fluke official website, that the TL75 test leads are compatible with this threaded alligator clip set. And here's all the information on the back of the packaging. So make sure to read through all of this information and all of these warnings and understand them and follow them completely. And whenever you're working with multimeters, make sure that you're wearing the proper safety equipment and take all safety precautions. I am going to take out the test leads before I install the threaded alligator clip set. Okay, so the alligator clips have a threaded shaft, and that's for some of the test leads, but for the TL75 test leads, they just slide on. Okay, so I'm going to put the black alligator clip on first, and just make sure that that slides all the way into place, and then I'm going to put the red alligator clip on, and just make sure that that slides all the way into place. Okay, so now I'm going to plug the test leads back into the Fluke 117 multimeter, and just make sure that you plug these into the correct spots. And where you plug the test leads into will depend on what you're testing. And this is important because if you have the test leads hooked up to the wrong spot on the multimeter, depending on where you have the dial set and what you're testing, you can cause a dangerous situation for yourself, the multimeter, or whatever you're testing. Okay, so I've had these for a while and I've used them to test different things. Like a while ago, I used them to test some of my arcade projects. And then more recently, I used them to test a doorbell transformer. I've also used these in some automotive testing. And they've worked really well for me. The um, jaws on the alligator clip have held really well and I haven't had any issues with those. So um, I've been happy with how well they've worked and they're easy to put on the TL75 test leads. And these were a little bit expensive, but for me it was worth it because I wanted to make sure that I got the official Fluke brand alligator clips. And it does say on the packaging that the jaws of the alligator clip open up to 7 millimeter. And the alligator clips do seem to stay on the test leads okay. You do have to put a little bit of force to get the alligator clips off. Okay, so here's my opinion on the threaded alligator clip set from Fluke. For me, they've worked great. I think they work really well on the TL75 test leads, and I think they're really good quality in my opinion. I do plan to upgrade to the threaded test leads eventually, so I'll be interested to see how well these work on the threaded test leads. I will link some of my other Fluke 117 videos at the end of this video, and if you're interested in half time, please check those videos out. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and if you have the time, check out these other great videos.